During a windy morning, Tia had decided to go out for a stroll in the park. At the other side, there was somebody who had gotten hurt. And his sister had screamed, Somebody, please help me! Then, when Tia arrived at that particular place, she asked, What's the matter? And his sister said, He fell down. Uh, can you please help him? And she said, No, I can't. I'm afraid. And so she started to run. I just couldn't. Can't do anything because I'm so fearful. If I'm fearful, then I won't be able to do anything. Then when she decided, when she arrived at her home, she sat down and started to think. I should have helped him. No, I wasn't so fearful. I would have helped him by now. He would have been okay. And so she went to her bedroom, and knelt down, and started to pray. Lord, please help me with this fear. I really need you. The next day, when she got up, she was wondering about how he was doing, and she thought she could go and check on him. So, while she was walking, she saw the little sister. Hey, how's your brother? she asked. She said, hi, he's okay. When the sister went home, he asked the brother if he wanted to go out. And so, while they were going on their walk, Tiana had saw them. And she asked how he was doing. The boy replied, fine, my leg's a bit better. After that incident, she decided that she had no more fear of blood anymore. And so, she went on a walk again. She saw this girl who was terribly sad about something. She asked, why? Why are you so sad? And then she said, um, I couldn't help somebody because of my fear of blood. And Tiana had said, me too. But you know what I did? The girl seemed interested and said, what? The, Tiana replied, I tried prayer. Maybe that might help you, she said. Well, thanks, replied the girl. So this moral of the story is that you have to ask God to help you with your fear.